Well, Harris, sir, what do you think? Well, yeah, I'm hearing a lot of Trump today. Black men typically are with Donald Trump. Black women are typically with Kamala Harris. Why is that? Because Kamala Harris is part of the Biden administration. They think they can go to a church, kiss a black baby, or listen to some hip hop, or get a rapper to come in front of us. And so the black community is a little bit more hip and conscious today. No, I ain't gonna lie, I'd take Trump back though. Trump, Trump, I supported Trump. Trump was a, a good supporter. Like, he was good. Like, I'm for president. He showed DC love. What did you think when you saw Trump get shot? Personally, I thought like, I, I thought like he, 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 he a strong person, so he's a strong guy. So I think like that was enough now. Why? Welcome back, Warriors. It's me, Linda B. Thank you all so much for joining me here today. Today, I got some Benny Johnson on the streets of D.C. He's asking people about whether or not they're going to go with Trump or Kamala Harris. But before we get into it, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. If you haven't already, hit that notification bell. And I kindly ask that you watch the video to the very end. Now, let's get into it. What do you think about Kamala Harris? Huh? What do you think about Kamala Harris? Who's that? Who's that? She's the vice president for um Biden. Come on, man. Who? Kamala Harris. Kamala Harris. Kamala Harris. Uh, she's the vice president. Now she's running for president. Kamala Harris. Huh? She's running for president now. Is uh, Joe Biden dropped out? Uh-huh. Uh huh. Do you like her? Uh, I don't know her. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> These are young people. And they seem to just like be like, what? That one young person was like trying to explain like she's the vice president for Biden. <laughs> you know, some people are just not connected to politics. They're just not connected. They're connected to other things. Doesn't mean they don't have intelligence. It just comes across like they just have not have not been paying attention. He's like, I don't know her. I'm like, wow. They don't give a damn about you. They don't like you. I don't like you. Nobody likes you. Come on, Harris. Come on, Harris. Yeah. Hey, it's about time a black woman get in the office. What is your favorite accomplishment for Kamala Harris? Uh, my, fa her fa my favorite accomplishment from her, I ain't really seen that she done. So, I mean, I hope she accomplishes some, some big things should she get in the office. But um, I really ain't really hearing nothing about what she's done. Kamala Harris, sir, what do you think? Well, yeah? I ain't gonna lie, I'd take Trump back, though. Trump 2024? Do not come. Do not come. I'm going to come. <gasps> Why did they just... Benny, you are so bad. Yo, what's up, guys? Your boy, Benny. Welcome to Chinatown in Washington, D.C. You can't get closer to the White House than right here. We are going to ask... Americans today, what they think about Kamala Harris, Camilla, Kamala, Kamala. Do you think you just fell out of a coconut tree? <laughs> we don't know, but we're going to find out today. Benny on the block, Washington, D.C. edition. What do people think? Let's go. So what do you think of Kamala Harris? She's beautiful. You sure about that? You sure about that? That was Willie Brown. I <laughs> <laughs> love Kamala Harris. <laughs> I was reading this article and it was like about like her past in California and stuff as an attorney general. Stop right there. And that kind of touched my heart. Damn. It touched my heart a lot. Personally, I don't agree with a lot of things she does. I don't agree with a lot of things Biden does. So for me, it's a no. No Kamala. Yeah. yeah. No. Yes. Not for me. Yeah. Yeah. As a Democrat, no. Uh, can you explain why you support Kamala Harris? For right now, if we don't want to be absolutely we we gotta vote come on at, at least at least put like a little bit of money towards her mm -hmm. presidential mm -hmm. i'm not gonna lie i did not know anything about kamala harris until now he's gonna be like if we're not gonna be he had a little profanity there then we need to support her and give some money to her campaign but then he hadn't really heard of her until now and 
probably don't even know anything about anything she's done. They just listen to talking points on the news. I, I just don't know. Um, I love Kamala. I think that she would do great things. I feel like she's a strong, young, and we need that right now in the world. Yeah, you're excited. Yeah, I'm excited. Kamala brings such more youth and youthfulness to, you know, what we haven't seen in a long time here in America. So I feel like it would be great. This is the worst. What do you think about Kamala Harris? Huh? What do you think about Kamala Harris? Who's that? Who that? Kamala Harris. She's running for president now. Is uh, Joe Biden dropped out? Uh-huh. Uh, do you like her? I don't know her. Yeah. She's now going to run as a Democrat for president. That's cool. Yeah. I guess she should. Do what you got to do. She's been in office for four years as Joe Biden's vice president. Mm -hmm. What is your favorite accomplishment in the last four years? Probably the amount of emphasis that they put on the black community. I feel like we need a lot of that right now. And we don't really get that shine a lot. Well, I think culture is, it is a reflection of our moment and our time, right? Uh -huh. Our moment and our time. And, and that young woman just just want to say a lot of shine on the black community a lot. But you got to do more than just be like this token or symbolism. You got to actually do something. And Kamala Harris just hasn't done anything. And people are basically saying they don't know anything that she's done. But when it comes to Donald Trump, they can just spew off things that he's done. She just sat there saying be unburdened by what has been and, and going to the past to get to where you're going and whatever, some crazy stuff. I don't even want to repeat her anymore because that's not, <laughs> it's not intelligent sounding stuff. So let's just get back into it. I don't know yet, but I got to see how she work. Do it first. Mm -hmm. If she do okay, now you know, she got, me, she got my vote. She's doing okay. She got my vote. So what's your favorite accomplishment? Um, Actually, I go to Spelman College, which is an HBCU in Atlanta. She actually came to our college and was able to talk to young girls like me just about what it is to be um in the White House and also looking like us being a black woman. So, yeah. yeah. So, I don't even know about it. I don't even know what she did for real. For she don't even look like us. I mean, you know, she was not like that young woman. She doesn't look like anything. I did. This man is just saying, I don't even know what she did. Like, I'm not going to lie. I was a bit clueless to like a week ago. This population, 18 through 24. They are stupid. What's your favorite accomplishment? Kamala Harris. Be right by the president's side. Uh, ain't an assistant now. Like she's supposed to. Wrong. We've been to the border. You haven't been to the border. I, and I haven't been to Europe. <laughs> I mean, I don't I kind of feel like Kamala Harris might be a placeholder or considered a placeholder in this economy and stuff like that. But, I mean, she's a great candidate compared to Trump. She's so bad. She's <laughs> so pathetic. She's so nervous. She's just so bad. Kamala Harris? Yeah. Hey, it's about time a black woman get in the office. Uh, I just hope they give her extra protection. My, fa her fa my favorite accomplishment from her? I ain't really seen that she done. So, I mean, I hope she accomplishes some, some big things should she get in office. But um, I really ain't really hearing nothing about what she's done. I'm just giving her the benefit of the doubt. Can I get a witness? <laughs> Kamala Harris or Trump? Cool. Kamala Harris? No comment. No, all right. no, no comment or no Kamala? No comment. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Trump 2024? Yep, yep. Kamala, why not Kamala, right? Why don't you like Kamala Harris? This is down with Biden. I think he had old L time. Was it yeah. L time? So, yeah, yeah, so that's pretty much it about that. But she, she covered up Biden. I'm not going to engage in that hypothetical because Joe Biden is very much alive. Why are you always lying? Kamala Harris, sir, what do you think? Well, yeah, I'm hearing a lot of Trump today. Let me. Typically, I would Donald Trump. Black women are typically with Kamala. Why is that? Because Kamala is uh, part of the Biden administration. They think they can go to a church, kiss a black baby, or listen to some hip hop, or get a rapper to come in front of us. And so the black community is a little bit more hip and conscious today. I ain't gonna lie, I'd take Trump back though. Trump, Trump, I supported Trump. Trump was a, a good supporter. Like, he was good. Like, I'm for president. He showed DC love. What did you think when you saw Trump get shot? Personally, I thought like, I, I thought, like, he's he, he, he a strong person, so he's a strong guy. So I think, like, that was enough now. A lot of people calling it a miracle. Yeah. A lot of people saying it looks like a miracle. Some people yeah. call it no, I didn't, no funny, I got shot in my head. I got shot in my neck and went to the back of my head. That's a miracle. Is that right there? Yeah, right That's there. It. 
That's a miracle. Really? Yeah. Was not planning on that. Right? Yeah. Half the people said Trump. <laughs> right there. They right down that street to the White House. So, uh, what was that? <laughs> it's got like Trump supporters here in Washington, D.C. What's going on? Uh, a lot of people saying they like Kamala if they did know who she was. Some didn't know who she was. If they did know who she was, they like Kamala. But that whole like accomplishments thing, like what has she done in four years? That's a tricky one. That one's tough. It's See, that's just the thing. You know, one man said, I don't know of anything that she's done. I'm just giving her the benefit of the doubt. Oh, they just see a woman of color. So, well, I'll just go with her. I'm like, she's still by Biden because that's what she's supposed to do. But they never, not, no one in this clip said anything that she's done. And I'm at a loss as to what has she done except ignore the border. You border czar. You did it. You had one job and you didn't do that. You didn't do that. Don't vote for people based on appearance. Vote, vote for people based on what they do. And when people show you who they are, believe them. Remember that famous quote by Maya Angelou? When they show you, now that's who they are, not what they say. Guys, thank you so much for joining me here today. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Made it to over 45,000 subscribers. Next goal, 50,000. You all be blessed. Love God, your families, these United States of America. And as they always say, march on warriors.